A mystery in her own backyard. A woman finds a creature but has no idea what this thing is. She says she doesn't know whether it's a reptile or a mammal. He's like, there's some strange animal in our yard. And I was like, what is it? And he's like, I don't know what it is. I don't know what the hell this is. It looks like a man. It's, it's... Well, just off uh, the side of the field, something glinting in the sun. As he got closer, he saw that this thing was spinning. What is it exactly? Is this real? Am I imagining things? Creepy calls. I've never seen anything like that before, ever. A Kansas couple felt uneasy about hearing strange voices from their farm fields nearly every other day. At first, they did not pay much attention until one of them insisted on installing a security camera. And here it is. The footage showed a weird hand that denied any human resemblance. It did not only appear, but also grab one of their cameras, which was never found again. It was as if the creature really minded being observed. Locals were looking into it when something more bizarre was spotted. A whole weird creature walking around in their fields. It was not that typical bear or wolf, and people said they were sure of it being a werewolf. Night Terror By now, you might have got the idea that the odds of running into a werewolf may be slim, but certainly not zero. This video surfaced by some residents in November 2020 shows a close encounter with a werewolf somewhere on a farm near a forest in Argentina. According to the source, it was on hearing loud noises of footsteps that the residents decided to investigate while recording. And here is what they just saw. A tall, dark, hairy, and indeed scary creature that came into view for a second and then just vanished into the dark. Better luck to the onlookers, who had been on their toes for quite long to capture it. Lurking Evil Imagine having a barbecue night with your family only to see a starving werewolf staring at you from a nearby tree. Look. What is that? A few years ago, a farmer from Ontario, while celebrating his harvest, noticed some weird glittering eyes peeking out. With no forest nearby, the chances of it being a regular old wolf were second to none. At first, he thought about using his hunting rifle to scare it off, but then, not being sure of what the creature actually was, decided to play safe. What he did was simply toss something hot for him at a distance. Curious to know what happened next? Sadly, this is where the clip ends, and no one knows what happened next. Deformed Dog In a Philippine village, a small puppy with one eye, dubbed the Cyclops Dog, gained attention for its unique appearance. The pup's two tongues and lack of a nose made breathing difficult. Despite being viewed as a curiosity, villagers sympathized with its condition. A local veterinarian suggested the mother may have ingested toxins, leading to the mutations. Though the puppy's life was short, the community rallied around it, offering support and understanding. The incident highlighted the importance of environmental awareness and care for animals. Panama Peculiarity after a tiring day in his Panama fields, a farmer stumbled upon an odd creature by a cliffside. It had a strange pinkish body, long limbs with clawed toes, and no fur. The farmer couldn't recognize it, nor could scientists. Some thought it might be a hairless, three-toed sloth, while others speculated it was an alien. Despite efforts, the creature remained unidentified, leaving a mystery in the area. One-Eyed Mystery while clearing debris on his Brazilian land, a farmer stumbled upon a bizarre creature unlike any known species. It lay lifeless on a rock, its brown hairless body looking eerie. Its eyes were fused and a strange trunk-like organ protruded from its forehead. Its ears were oddly stuck to its head, adding to its unsettling appearance. Despite close examination, the creature remained unidentified. Initially thought to be a mutated calf, 
Its peculiar trunk and unusual hooves suggested it was something entirely unfamiliar, leaving the farmer puzzled by the mysterious discovery. Oh. Unidentified carcass. I'm hiking in the woods and fall, and I found the freakiest damn thing. I mean, I don't know what this thing is. Imagine buying new land for your crops and stumbling upon a strange creature carcass lying in the sand. Either this is some extraterrestrial being or a poor soul that met its end shortly after birth. This is the weirdest damn thing, and it, it feels like leather. However, on a closer look, it shows quite a resemblance with the monkey family. Curious to know what exactly this was, the owner took it with him. He said he would consult the experts, and guess what? Even the researchers were not sure of what it was. If it was a monkey, its skin would not have been of a leathery texture. I suppose we'll just have to wait patiently for the accurate results. Pictures I sent are uh, accurate. I mean, this is the same thing, you know. I, I don't know what it is. Sooty remains. Okay, so I was ready for something odd, but definitely not the remains of some creature unknown. A few years back, down under his farm soil, an Australian farmer dug out something really bizarre. He said that he had been smelling foul for the past few days, and now it really was getting out of hand. And of course, the stink was for a reason. The creature encountered an unfortunate mishap that left it in a rather sad state, where even its skin was not present. All they could tell from the bones was that it looked like some kind of canine. Squirrel-mouse combo. Where residents of one suburban neighborhood are wondering, what is this freaking thing roaming around our yards? What's that thing? A bald squirrel or a baby chupacabra? That's what the guy wondered as he wandered around his fields and spotted this strange creature. It looked like a big squirrel mixed with a dash of mouse, strutting around like it owned the place. Instead of spooking it, the farmer secretly recorded a video and sent it off to wildlife management. Guess what? They had never seen such a creature like this before and were confused about what to say. The wildlife officials say, no, no. What the hell is that thing? Creepy Anomaly if this sight doesn't send shivers down your spine, I don't know what will. A lonely worker near his farm cabin stumbled upon a massive eerie creature lying lifeless just a few meters away. While its overall appearance resembled that of a canine, it's clear that something much larger and more powerful has inflicted damage upon it. With a tar-like coating covering most of its body and small areas of its skin missing, what was this creature, and what could have led to its demise? If you have any ideas, please let us know in the comments below. Roadside Remains One morning, what this farmer found were the strange remains of an animal by the roadside near the farm. Tense to know what this eerie life form was, he kept on inspecting, but couldn't figure out what kind it belonged. Even for us, it does not look like anything we know. The most unfortunate aspect is that the body was somewhat affected, probably by other animals. Some people thought maybe it was an ostrich that tried to run away from the farm, but met an end and became food for other animals. Whatever it was, one thing was for sure, no one was forgetting this creepy sight anytime soon. Grim Reminder Nature's rules can be quite unforgiving at times. Take a look at this deer skeleton discovered by a farmer while plowing his fields. It appeared as though some wild animal had consumed its prey, leaving behind only remnants. After this grim discovery, the farmer became concerned about the presence of potentially harmful wild animals in the vicinity. That could pose a threat to his livestock. Despite thorough searching, no traces of wild creatures were found nearby. Eventually, as a precautionary measure, he decided to have his guard dogs patrol the area for added safety. Extraordinary. Oh my God, it's have a you ever seen egg. anything like this? Ever seen eggs in colors other than white? Well, get ready for a surprise. A Nigerian farmer recently discovered something truly unexpected. His not-so-normal chickens were laying blue eggs. At first, he thought it was because of the tough times brought on by the country's economic woes, and maybe even some politician curses. But hey, why go so far? 
Let us just say that it could be a cool genetic twist, right? Colossal Carapaces Once you catch sight of this creature, you'll forget all about the burrow digging rodent seen before. While herding his cattle by a stream, an Argentinian farmer came across some odd bumps in a dried up patch. Worried, he called the local authorities, who were shocked to find massive glyptodon fossil shells. These car-sized relics, thought to be 20,000 years old, were lined up as if marching towards something. With a digger, they unearthed two adults and two young specimens. Now experts are investigating their age and what led to the demise of these ancient giants. Aboreal Remains Alien creature on the beach. Isn't that creepy? With its strange head, twisted body, and skinny legs, these skeletal remains were found by a farmer while trolling near his lands. Without any hesitation, the man quickly called it an alien skeleton, thanks to the experts who jumped in at the exact time and revealed that it was no human or other living creature, but instead a strangely shaped tree trunk. Well, I would like to witness some family members of this tree standing straight with their roots deep down, showcasing their terror due to their tremendous size. Cosmic Knickknack This video posted a few years back has something like, extraterrestrials are here and hatching a plan. Oval shape, rocky texture with a little hair growth on the sides, this bizarre creature was discovered in a basement when a farmer went down to check the grains. After many failed guesses, it was assumed to be an alien egg as nothing like that has ever been witnessed before. And if it was an alien egg, then we have to see which planet the egg belongs to and which alien species would hatch it soon. Piggy-Human Hybrid In South America, a farmer was left stunned when one of his pigs gave birth to a litter of eight piglets, among which was a peculiar-looking newborn. This particular piglet had features that seemed almost human-like, resembling a hybrid between a pig and a human. Sadly, the newborn appeared weak compared to its siblings and struggled to stand on its own. Concerned about its survival, the farmers contemplated whether this unique creature was extraterrestrial, a hybrid, or a genetic mutation. They decided to closely monitor its condition in intensive care until the medical authorities arrived. Just like everyone else, were eagerly awaiting the results too. By facial birth. After those oddly beautiful animals above, here's this two-headed calf. Two-headed calf, it, that, you know, that's it. I cannot believe it. You know, I've heard of them, but I've never seen one before. In 2015, a farmer was taken aback when his cow in Baker County, Florida, gave birth to a calf with two faces. Named Annabelle, the calf possessed two heads, four eyes, two ears, two mouths, and two noses. Sadly, its two-brain coordination was a challenge, making feeding from its mother impossible. If you don't know this rare condition, known as dicephalic parapagus, occurs when embryos fail to split properly, possibly due to genetic factors. Although the man was determined to look after this calf, all knew it would not survive for long. I would like to see her live and, <laughs> and actually be able to, to get up and walk and function. Deep. This is the progeny of a goat out of a Chevy jaw. A goat and a, a, a goat, goat and a Chevy, sheep. a Chevy is sheep. Yeah. So it's a, a I don't a, know what you call it. A jeep or a jeep. A jeep, a jeep. Yeah. Some good. of the boys are telling me it's a jeep. Now, who wants to own this cool pet animal? You don't have to worry about what this animal is because in 2000, this Irish farmer was also taken aback when one of his sheep gave birth to this unusual offspring, resembling a goat. After various hints. It came to be that during the ewes breeding season, there were no male sheep around, and she had crossed paths with a billy goat instead, resulting in the birth of a remarkable hybrid known as a geep. This adorable creature had the head of a goat and the body of a sheep, complete with a thick coat of wool. I'm fairly surprised by how nimble he is for a... Oh, he's like a deer, yeah. yeah. Unbelievable, he's so, so fast now, you'd have to get into the pen to catch him, like there's no chance you'd catch him otherwise. Making us all believe that even accidents have their beauty. Mama's Fury When it comes to children's safety, a mama never compromises on it. 
A farmer in northwestern Canada found a mother wolf trapped in a bear claw trap alongside her cub. Many of us would just get scared of the wild beast, but this guy was taken by the innocence of her cub, deciding to help the poor family. The good guy took them to a cage with the intent of treating their scratches. It was just a perfect rescue story until the mother noticed the cub elsewhere and probably furious about her little one being moved, jumped upon the farmer's camera. Luckily, a veterinarian was called in timely, who was said to have treated their scratches professionally and later freed them. <laughs> Demonic Python 115 pounds and 18 feet long, hunters caught this massive Burmese python full of eggs. Now that's really huge! Back in April 2020, three men in Florida were stunned to stumble upon a massive Burmese python. Nestled in the southwestern part of the state, you will not believe that this leviathan stretched a whopping tipping the scales at 180 pounds. Confused on how to deal with such an enormous creature, the group called the Preserve Rangers, who were said to have arrived shortly after, relocating the python away from the area. I bet it was one of the largest of this species we have ever seen. So we want to show you just how long this snake is, 18 feet. Here we go, let's check, we're at, keep going, we're at, 18 feet right here. So long that it actually spanned the entirety of our shot. Burrowing Champions Hey, little guy. If there were a championship for professional animal diggers, armadillos would definitely take the crown. A farmer caught wind of an armadillo roaming his fields after spotting several abandoned burrows scattered around. With his trusty dog by his side, he managed to track down its current location. And guess what? He was busy digging another burrow. The farmer could not afford to keep this up for long and decided to soon reach out to wildlife management to take the rodent away. <laughs> Alive under snow. Here's this video as a tribute to this strong critter. Footage shows the dramatic moments Galloway farmer Stuart Max here discovered sheep still alive after 11 days buried under a huge snowdrift. While searching for his missing sheep after a heavy snowfall, a Galloway farmer unearthed a remarkable sight. What he saw was an eye blinking back at him from a huge pile of snow and dead sheep. Despite being buried for up to 11 days, the resilient four-year-old Scotch Mole Cross had managed to survive. It seemed as if he knew his owner would find him against all the odds. Thankfully, the farmer rescued it and took the shivering soul to a nearby farm to recover in warmth. We think someone deserves a hot bubble bath. Epic ears. Look at this adorable goat. Now check out this goat's ears. So this farmer decides to show off one of his coolest finds, a goat with the most epic long ears you've ever seen. Just look at these talking, silky, flowing ear curtains. It's as if the mammal had it got its ears made on special request. Anyhow, this beautiful animal is called Simba. Because let's be real, it's the king of the farm with those ears. Simba's not just a regular goat, but a superstar. Its extraordinary ears did not only make him, but also his owner, a famous man all over the internet. He said that he had been continuously contacted by animal farmers who were eager to drop by and meet the goat with the legendary ears face to face. The world has famous and I have also given me a fame. I was farming in the past 4 years goat farming. I didn't know so much people who knew so much in 30 days mein Simba has introduced me. Cobra Tango Another farm, another wild story. A farmer in Thailand spotted something wild by her farm pond. Two big king cobras were tangled up in her fence, like a couple of reckless teenagers. She was no snake charmer and therefore called for backup until the rescue arrives. Do you have any idea what these snakes are or what they are doing? Anyhow, two brave souls arrived at a spot, and as these snakes were in a real bind, the rescuers got to work sniping away at the mess. After a bit of struggle, they finally got those cobras free. Ah! Nothing much, just a mating ritual it was. Wrapping them up like precious cargo, they released the love-struck reptiles back into the wild. Oh, 
Turkey trouble. A video recently surfaced revealing deformed turkeys found at a farm in North Wales, United Kingdom. The footage depicts numerous deformed turkeys crammed into a single cage, exhibiting twisted wings, misshapen bills, and stunted feathers, suggesting they're suffering from an unknown condition. Following the outcry, the farm was immediately shut down with an investigation to bring to the surface the cause of these deformities. Yes, I know that this incident has raised many questions on the animal welfare of the UK, but as the matter has gained quite a furious attention, let's just hope that the authorities will be taking some serious action. Tree tucked tot. The baby born, the baby uh, before cutting the placenta, so the baby is uh, washed and then uh, wrap it and then put it into there. With the most unique belief systems in the world, the Tarjan people of Indonesia are my current center of attention because of their unique burial customs, especially the burying of their young ones in trees. These people bury their babies in trees with the belief that they will be absorbed by nature. It is not for all, but the infants who pass away without milk teeth. They belong to the baby who died before getting teeth. Totally pure and sinless. Little ones are wrapped in ferns and tucked into trees as if giving hugs to nature. This special way of saying goodbye is a big part of their traditions. One pig is sacrificed. When we say that this is a poor family, so where does the one pig come from? One pig comes from all the people who come to bury the baby here. Big Horned Bulls If you were a farmer, would you be interested in keeping these long-horned cows? Famous for their iconic horns stretching over 100 inches, these animals are proof of majestic beauty. On average, their horns span six feet or more, but in exceptional cases like a 15-year-old steer, they can reach a whole nine feet. But wait, there's more. In Alabama, a Texas longhorn steer named Poncho has clinched the Guinness World Record for the longest set of horns ever. This one's had so many people over the years stop by to see him. At six years old, Poncho boasts horns measuring an astonishing 10 feet. 7.4 inches from tip to tip. Raised by the Pope family on their farm, Poncho is known as a friendly giant, standing tall with his impressive prongs. And healthy, he no hoof problems, horn problems, or anything. Holy Gators. Only place in the world that you can find friendly crocodiles. The luxurious life these mighty reptiles are living is a dream of all other living creatures. In Bazul, Africa, instead of getting scared of these ferocious reptiles, they are massively respected. I know, right? It was hard for me to believe, too. But wait until you see them playing with children living in the area. The villagers believe they're holy and responsible for their property. So the story is that one of these crocs saved them during a drought long ago, leading them to water. And now everyone adores them like they're some big scaly pets. I'm about to sit on this monster. Um, this is the only place in the world you can find a crocodile like this. Mesozoic Mysteries Kudos to these workers of China's Yuan province who, during their construction, made a stunning discovery. Two large bones of Jurassic-era reptiles, Lufungaceras magnus and Lufungaceras henni, were about 500 meters apart. One of them could have been a whopping 9 meters long. These fossils are like a time capsule dating back around 108 million years to the Mesozoic era. And guess what? Archaeologists are now curious more than ever to dig deeper, saying that they are darn sure there exists more amazing stuff waiting to be bright on the surface. So why not? Royal Reveal The news headlines, the king in the car park, the secrets Richard III took to his grave as his final resting place is revealed. Yeah, yeah, I know that I am digressing a bit from my topic, but look at this masterpiece of excavation I stumbled upon. Casually browsing through historical discoveries, I stumbled upon quite the gem. Y you won't believe it, but they found King Richard III of England buried under a car park in Leicester. I'm not removing it yet. I need to find out whether it's an articulated skeleton. Back in 1485, after Richard's demise, the clergy of Greyfriars 
hastily buried him near their altar, sans coffin or shroud. Centuries later, DNA evidence confirmed the skeleton's identity, linking it to Richard III. Now that they've uncovered it, the whole place is getting special protection because, well, it's a big deal. Just goes to show you that history has a way of popping up where you least expect it. Button Bonanza This video will force you to dig up your areas and look for some chances to get richy rich. What these people found during an excavation on a Missouri farm field was the long-lost steamboat named Malta. It was not an ordinary wooden vehicle, but a whole package of 150 gold buttons dating back to the 19th century. These buttons were probably part of the passengers' clothes, showing the excellent craftsmanship of that time. Whoa! That was unexpected. Terracotta Treasure from digging and excavating, but the crew digging this pool did all the right things when they unearthed these bones. If you are one of those who really love to study historical artifacts, then this discovery is surely for you. Back in 1974, Chinese farmers hit the jackpot while digging for water during a nasty drought. What they found beneath the parched earth wasn't just any old well, it was an entire army made of terracotta. Yep, life-sized soldiers, horses, and chariots all guarding Emperor Qin Sha Hung in the afterlife. You're going back into the hill? This is the upper arm bone or the humerus? Imagine stumbling upon 8,000 ghostly warriors meticulously crafted over 2,000 years. It's like stepping into a time machine, right? These farmers accidentally unlocked a piece of history that still blows our minds today. Who knew a little digging could unearth such a massive treasure trove? Ultra Cows if you are an animal lover who is always curious to know about farming and breeding strategies, you definitely would have seen this one before. So, it was these Belgian scientists who teamed up to create something special they called a super cow. Now, the question was how? So, what they did was to mix a native cow with a short horn bull and kept picking the biggest and strongest ones to breed. The Belgian blue bull was born. These super cows have extra muscles more milk and lots of protein, but not as amazing as it seems because their huge size comes with health issues. Still, they're like real-life superheroes in the animal kingdom. Heroic Elephant Rescue Here's some heartwarming content for you. You probably would have never seen an elephant receiving CPR, but here is this site from Nakhon Nayak Province, Thailand that will warm your heart. A mother and baby elephant fell into a seven-foot hole, and a farmer quickly called for help. With the assistance of vets and local farmers, they managed to rescue the mother using a crane. However, in her distress, the mother knocked herself unconscious. The vets sprang into action, performing CPR on the mother elephant to save her life. Thankfully, she made it through, and both mother and calf returned to the wild, safe and sound. Flames Defeated The best among you all is the one who is helpful to others. And here's this real-life example of some cool farmer friends. In 2013, a Colorado county was seen blazing with ferocious fire flames. When the firefighters did not seem to arrive at the location anytime soon, a friendly farmer zoomed in with his big tractor to help. Using tractors, he dug a big line in the dirt to keep the flames away. Working like heroes, they saved the day and made sure everyone was safe. It's awesome how neighbors can be like superheroes when things get tough. Warwolf After watching this clip, you will say that werewolves aren't as tough as Hollywood makes them seem. Taken in 1942, the video shows an elite unit of soldiers who are able to shoot down a big, black, hairy creature with sharp teeth, long ears, and a body structure that was part human, part wolf. According to soldiers, this werewolf-like creature was wreaking havoc on the Germans until the best shooters and trackers were sent to hunt it down and take it out. But let me be clear, as the story is from World War II, we can hardly confirm the authenticity of the story. Mother's Call <coughs> On this old farmer's farm, Something straight out of a Disney movie was recorded to happen. A mama deer welcomed a new baby, but the next day she was bawling her eyes out for her little one. The elderly gentleman, being the hero he is, 
sniffed out the situation, and found the fawn stuck in a rabbit hole, squeaking for help. With a bit of farmer magic, he scooped up the tiny deer and set it free. The fawn dashed back to its mama, and together they scampered off into the wild, living happily ever after. Brushwood Drama Have you ever thought of randomly bumping into a wolf? Most probably not. Well, this Oregon farmer who was busy working managed to get incredibly close to a wolf. Luckily, the wind was on her side, carrying away her scent and the sound of her footsteps. Plus, the bushes provided some extra cover. But following the advice to make her presence known, she accidentally blew her cover and the wolf got alarmed. But it is not what we are all thinking because the woman was really lucky as the wolf did a quick exit stage left and disappeared into the bushes, leaving her unharmed. Jungle Nursery Isn't it fascinating to see someone other than a human benefiting from a shelter? especially at the most vulnerable stage of life? A heartwarming sight was recorded by this farmer's CCTV camera when a leopard gave birth to four healthy cubs inside the hut. Just look at those little fur balls. Too cute for words, right? I think the mother knew what dangers were present nearby and carefully moved them one by one to a safer spot in the bushes. In an interview, the farmer mentioned feeling lucky that all this magic happened right on his farm and counted it as a good luck charm. Bottle Tree Imagine going on a tour to Africa and finding out about this amazing tree-producing tree. I would have passed unnoticed if my eyes had not caught this Hadzba man scaling a colossal baobab tree. On inquiring, he said his mission was to tap into its water reserves. This species stores up to 100,000 gallons of water in its spongy trunk. Found in northern Tanzania, they are an incredible lifeline for the Hadzba which are the Earth's last hunter-gatherer tribe. It is through these trees that they drink water in this dry land, showing us how humans and nature can be best friends, helping each other out. It's time for today's open discussion. The video starts shaky, making it hard to see the creature. See, there it is! Not so huge, with brown fur and some extra lion-like mane near its neck trying to jump into the farm area with its short legs. Probably wanting to feast on some animal from the inside? But what on Earth is it after all? Some say it resembles a mix of a rabbit and a wombat, whereas others claim it could be a child in costume, a sick sun bear, or even a joke like Man Bear Pig from South Park. Whatever the figure is, we just pray for everyone's safety from such unknown dangers roaming around us. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.